page 17. Lesson 2. How the dog found himself a new master. Before you read, you may know that the dog and the wolf are closely related. You may also know something about how over the centuries human beings have domesticated and tamed wild animals. Here is a story about how the dog became a tame animal. 1. Dogs were once their own masters and lived the way wolves do, in freedom, until a dog was born who was ill-pleased with this way of life. He was sick and tired of wandering about by himself looking for food and being frightened of those who were stronger than he. Page 18 2. He thought it over and decided that the best thing for him to do was to become the servant of one who was stronger than anyone on earth and he set out to find such a master. 3. He walked and he walked and he met a kinsman of his, a big wolf who was as strong as he was fierce. Where are you going, dog? the wolf asked. I am looking for someone to take up service with. Would you like to be my master, wolf? I don't see why not, the wolf said. And this agreed upon. The two of them went on together. 4. They walked and they walked, and all of a sudden the wolf lifted his nose, sniffed, darted quickly off the path and into the bushes and crept deeper into the forest. The dog was much surprised. What's come over you, master? he asked. What has frightened you so? Can't you see? There's a bear out there, and he might eat up both of us, you and me. 5. Seeing that the bear was stronger than the wolf, the dog decided to take up service with him. And he left the wolf and asked the bear to be his master. The bear agreed to this readily and said, Let us go and find a herd of cows. I'll kill a cow and then we can both eat our fill. New Words in the Box, page 18 Kinsman Old-fashioned word for a relative. Fierce, violent, frightening. Take up service with, become the servant of. Darted, moved quickly, suddenly. Come over you, affected you. Page 19 6. They walked on and soon have a herd of cows. But just as they were about to come up to it, they were stopped by a terrible noise. The cows were mooing loudly and running in a panic in all directions. 7. The bear looked out from behind a tree and then he too ran hastily deeper into the forest. Page 20 Now why did I have to come here? said he to the dog. It is the lion who rules the forest in these parts. The lion? Who is he? Don't you know? He is the strongest beast on earth. Well, then I'll say goodbye to you, bear. I want a master who is stronger than anyone on earth. 8. And off the dog went to ask the lion to be his master. The lion agreed to it, and the dog stayed with him and served him for a long, long time. It was a good life, and he had nothing to complain of, for there was no stronger beast in the forest than the lion, and no one dared touch the dog or offend him in any way. 9. But one day the two of them were walking side by side along the path that ran amid bare cliffs when all of a sudden the lion stopped. He gave a great roar and struck the ground angrily with his paw with such force that a hole formed there. Then he began to back away very quietly. What is it, master? Is anything wrong? asked the dog, surprised. I smell a man coming this way, the lion said, 
we'd better run for it or we will be in trouble. Oh, well, then I'll say goodbye to you, lion. I want a master who is stronger than anyone on earth. New words in the box, page 20. Dead, to be brave enough to do something. Cliff, a steep, high rock, often at the edge of the sea. Page 21. 10. And off the dog went to join the man, and he stayed with him and served him faithfully. This happened long, long ago, but to this day the dog is man's most loyal servant and knows no other master. Working with the text A. Discuss these questions in pairs before you write the answers. 1. Why did the dog feel the need for a master? 1. 2. 2. Who did he first choose as his master? Why did he leave that master? 3. Who did he choose next? 5. 4. Why did he serve the lion for a long time? 8. 5. Who did he finally choose as his master and why? 9. 10. B. A summary of the story is given here. Fill in the blanks to complete it taking appropriate phrases from the box. A dog, stronger than anyone else, the strongest of all, a wolf, the bear, afraid of man, his own master, a lion. This is the story of blank, who used to be blank. He decided to find a master blank. First he found blank, but the wolf was afraid of blank. The dog thought that the bear was blank. After some time, the dog met blank, who seemed the strongest. He stayed with the lion for a long time. One day, he realized that the lion was blank. To this day, the dog remains man's best friend. Page 22 Working with language A. Each word in the box given here indicates a large number of, for example, a herd of cows refers to many cows. Complete each of the following phrases with a suitable word from the box. School, fleet, brood, bundle, bunch, pack, flock, herd. 1. A blank of ships. 2. A blank of flowers. 3. A blank of chicks. 4. A blank of cattle. 5. A blank of sticks. 6. A blank of sheep. 7. A blank of fish. 8. A blank of wolves. B. Make nouns from the words given by adding ness or it. For some words, we need to add just ty or y. 1. Honest, blank. 2. Kind, blank. 3. Cruel, blank. 4. Calm, blank. 5. Sad, blank. 6. Active, blank. 7. Creative, blank. 8. Sincere, blank. 9. Cheerful, blank. 10. Bitter, blank. 11. Sensitive, blank. 12. Great blank. Page 23. C. 
words search. One, there are twelve words hidden here in this table. Two, six can be found horizontally and the remaining six vertically. Three, all of them are describing words like good, happy, etc. Four, the first letters of the words are given below. Horizontal, H, R, F, F, S, G. Vertical, A, W, S, F, L, Q. Page 24. Read the following passage and do the exercises that follow. Then complete the family tree of dogs given on the facing page. The Dog Family The dog family is one of the 11 families that make up the carnivorous, a large group of intelligent, flesh-eating, backboned animals. In this group are such varied animals as bears, pandas, raccoons, cats, hyenas, and even seal. The dog or canine family has many wild species like wolves, foxes, coyotes, jackals and wild dogs. The dog is the only domesticated member of the canine family, though now and then someone tames a wolf, fox or coyote as a pet. All members of the dog family are descendants of a wolf-like animal which lived about 15 million years ago. From this distant ancestor, the true dogs gradually developed, but nobody knows the exact ancestor of the modern domestic dog. Several wild dogs look and behave like domestic dogs. The dingo or wild dog of Australia is one of these. It is possible that the dingo was a tamed dog brought to Australia long ago, which then ran wild. Dogs were the first animals tamed by humans, perhaps 20,000 years ago. Tamed dogs were brought from Asia to the New World 5,000 or more years ago. Dogs were first used for hunting. 1. Find the opposites of these words in the text above. 1. Ancestor. Blank. 2. Wild. T. Blank. M. Blank. 3. Ancient. Blank. 4. Near. D. Blank. T. 4. Suddenly. G. R. Blank. 2. Complete the following sentences. 1. The dinjo is. Blank. 2. Dogs were the blank animals tamed by humans. The other animals tamed by humans are think and name some other such animals. 3. The new world refers to blank. Dogs were brought there from blank. Page number 25. Here are some pictures of family tree of dogs. Recognize them and name them. Page 26. Speaking. Here are some points from a similar story that you might have heard in another language. Dividing the class into two groups, try and tell the story in English. One person from each group can speak alternately. Your teacher will help you. As you tell it, one of you may write it down on the board. A Mouse Maiden 1. Mouse changed into a girl by a magician. 2. Wants to marry the strongest person. 3. Asks whether sun or cloud stronger. Why? 4. But mountain stronger than clouds. How? 5. But mouse stronger than mountain. How? 6. Girl asks to marry mouse becomes a mouse again. The last ride together. There was a young man of Niger 
who went for a ride on a tiger. They returned from their ride with the man inside and a smile on the face of the tiger.